There are four instrument families in an orchestra. Strings, percussion, brass, and woodwinds. Let's take a closer look at one of those families today. Well, hello there. Hey, I like that hat. Oh, it reminds me of when I used to play t-ball. Anyway, my name is Thomas. That is the official machine of musical instrument selection. And I'm here to help you choose an instrument to play. So, what do you say we get right into it? Superb! <laughs> okay, here's a list of some adjectives that describe a whole bunch of different kinds of musical instruments. Go ahead and pick some of the words from the list describing your ideal instrument, and I'll figure out which instrument family it falls into. All right, let's play ball! <laughs> Thunderous, like the sound just after lightning strikes. No explanation needed for that one, I would think. Sharp! Nice choice, I would have picked that one too. Textured, oh, also a nice choice. Kind of like sandpaper on wood. Accented, like my aunt, she has the thickest Canadian accent. What's it all about, eh? Forceful, like two rams butting horns, or maybe a slamming door, ooh, ooh, or a ram slamming a door. <laughs> all right, uh, give me just a moment as I process your answers. This won't take long. Or, wow, maybe it will actually. <laughs> oh, that, nope, there we go. Got it. Okay, great. Based on the words you picked out of the four instrument families in an orchestra, an instrument family that you would most likely enjoy is the percussion family. Here's a bit of info about this family. Percussion instruments are probably the most ancient of all instruments besides your very own voice. People from way back when used things like sticks or their pet rocks to bang on their early makeshift percussion instruments. Nowadays, percussion instruments make their sound by being shaken, rattled, rubbed, scraped, or struck by objects called beaters, which could be drumsticks, mallets, tubes, and so on and so forth. Some of the percussion instruments are pitched, like the xylophone, and some are unpitched, which means they have no identifiable pitch, like some, but not all, of the drums. Regardless, the sounds percussion instruments make are often loud, strong, sharp, and really help accent a piece of music. At other times, they're mellower, even gentle, like a whisper, or the sound of the trees, leaves in the wind, or... Uh, you get the idea. Now, the percussion family is a big family, kind of like my dad's side. He has 20 siblings. No joke. Anyways, some of the more common instruments in the percussion family include the bass drum, Chimes, cymbals, gong, marimba, snare drum, tambourine, timpani. Triangle, and the xylophone. So, based on what you just heard regarding the percussion family, is there an instrument that you're hankering to try out? The snare drum! Great! Hey, you could be a modern day little drummer boy, one that wears a baseball hat. Anyway, you think about that idea while I do a little bit of processing here. A little processing there, a bit more processing on top, and done! Go ahead and take a look in the box. Bam! Your very own snare drum! Thank you! Oh, you're most welcome. Now, go and play that snare drum with dignity and your head held high. 